Hello and welcome Chippewa fans to CMUChippewas.com as we're here in Detroit, Michigan for the 2012 Mac Media Day. Justin Hoff with you alongside Eric Fisher, senior offensive lineman for the Chippewas. Eric, uh, what's this day been like so far for you? You know, the last couple of years you've gotten a lot of starts, but uh, yet to get to Mac Media Day and here you are today. Yeah, it's a great opportunity uh, for an offensive lineman to be here. Usually we don't get much uh, credit, I, I guess, or press. But, uh, you know, this is a big opportunity for me to represent the Chips. A big Chippewa, certainly 6'6", six, 6'7", six, six, over 300 pounds. Uh, Mike Cummings always likes his uh, linemen over 300. And we, we've seen uh, the offensive line have a lot of success the last couple of years. Four of the five projected starters on the offensive line are seniors. Uh, just talk about what it's like to, to be with these guys and that much experience. Yeah, you know, we've been together for the last two to three years. We've started so many games next to each other. We don't even have to make calls anymore on the offensive line. You know, we know exactly what each other's doing. And, uh, you know, it's a great opportunity. You know, the most seniors on the line we've had since I've been here is two. Uh, so, you know, it's, uh, it's a chance for us not only to lead the team, but lead the younger guys, you know, for the future and teach them uh, the way things work around the, the trenches. Inside the trenches, of course, for you guys, the running game, looking to get that going this year as well as the, the passing game. And, you know, you have some seniors, of course, Ryan Radcliffe and Cody Wilson out there at wide receiver. 19 seniors in all for you guys. That's right up there with any team in the Mid-American Conference. You could say, you know, you talked about the offensive line having more than just two seniors there, that this, this senior class could be the strongest senior class that the Chippewas have seen maybe all the way back to 2009 when you guys finished out the some of the season here at the Ford Field in the championship game. What makes this year's senior class so strong? You know, just uh, as far as the offense goes, you know, we've been playing, like I said, the O-line's been playing the last two, three years together. Actually, our entire offense has been playing together for the last two to three years. You know, uh, we've struggled at times, but, you know, we're really looking at uh, showing the country what we can produce as an offense and uh, you know not only on offense but on defense you know we have some great leadership from Jaleel and uh, Joe Kinville out there and uh, you know I think together you know the offense and defense is going to get stuff done this year. We talk about the offense so much of course because you're an offensive lineman you have nine of the 11 starters coming back for this next year. How much fun could this offense have uh, to produce a, a lot of offense for the, for the Chippewa fans? Not only like just produce, uh, you know, we have such an opportunity with our, our schedule. You know, we have seven home games, of course, and, you know, it's just such an opportunity. We have State at home, Western at home, Navy at home, and, you know, it's it's huge that we can produce, uh, you know, a run game and a pass game. As long as we get the run game down pat, you know, I think we'll be able to do remarkable things. On the ride up here to uh, Detroit and uh, Mac Media Day, we were talking about the fans and how important they are to the success of your team. You know, not only at the start where you guys run right out there to the student section, but at halftime to see them there. How important will that be for this season in that seven game home schedule that features Michigan State, Navy, and Western Michigan? Hey, you know, uh, running out those first two games, you know, our first two games are home. And, you know, opening day, we always got a great crowd, and Michigan State's going to be absolutely amazing. But those two games are going to set up the rest of the season for the fans, you know, to come watch us because, you know, we're going to show them that we're back and we're ready to play football. Is there a certain home game that you're looking forward to most when, when you start talking about uh, Western Michigan or Michigan State? You know, for me, Western Michigan's always a big one, but Michigan State this year, with it, all the, the buildup, for me, I'm really looking forward to that game. How about for you? Yeah, it's a, an amazing opportunity. You know, how often do you get a Big Ten school in a, uh, you know, a max conference school? Um, you know, it's something that you know, I'll never forget in my life, whatever, whatever the outcome is that day, you know, um, we're going to we're going to come in that game very prepared and we're going to, you know, butt heads just like we did last year, except this year we're going to get the job done. A couple more for you. Jaleel Adai, sharp dressed man here at uh, Mac Media Day. I know you were asked about him. You, you look pretty good yourself. Uh, big guy. Uh, what do you think of uh, Jaleel's outfit and how about your outfit? You know, I went for more of the conservative look today. You know, I'm just uh rocking the white white shirt and the tie, but Jaleel over there, uh, he calls it swag or swagging out or something like that. I'm not really a swag guy, but uh, you know, he makes it work and uh, you know, that's it's who he is. Last question for you. Back in 2009, you guys created memories right here in Detroit. 
MAC championship. What would it mean for the Chippewas to come back here and bounce back after two tough seasons and uh, finish out the season with another championship? Yeah, you know, I got my ring on today, and it's a constant reminder from that season. You know, we want to get another one, and it's it's just, you know, every time I look at that, it's and wearing it in this house where we earned it, you know, I just want to get back here so bad, and I want to do it again. All right, Eric, uh, thanks for joining us, and uh, enjoy the rest of the day here at Mac Media. Yeah, thank you very much. That's Eric Fisher. The offensive lineman, a senior, one of 19 seniors for your Chippewas here in 2012. Be sure to stay tuned to CMUChippewas.com throughout the rest of the day for more interviews right here from Detroit, Michigan on Mac Media Day. Stay tuned for more here on the CMU Sports Network. Justin Hoff with you. Thanks for watching.